Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Seb's SMS. I'm sending you a message about having a sense of urgency. Yes guys, this is the message I'm sending you today. <laughs> so guys, if you want to know why, it's going to be more motivational than structure. But if you want to know why, just stay put, right? I'm here for you and I'm going to talk about that. That's the message I'm sending you. You better catch it. Let's go. Yo, what's happening, my people? Saturday morning session. Here we are. <laughs> We're here. We're here. We change scenes again because you know I like when things are changing a little bit. You gotta be unpredictable. But why are we here? But first and foremost, how are you? How are you feeling? Talk to me a little bit. How do I feel? I'm in pain. I've played a game with the Spurs legend. Honestly, my hips, and you know me, my hips are shattered, but I can't move. Woo! It took me a good week, a good couple of days to be able to recover. But we're still here, you know? It's all in here, all in the brain. So, what are you saying? How was your week? Talk to me. But what are we here today for? We're here, you know, it's a sports environment. It's a sport environment for what? Track. This includes a lot of sport. You know, track and field. I don't know. You, when you, I don't even know how you call that. Javelin, a lot of things in that facility. But because of what? Last week we spoke about being patient. God save the king. You get me? But this week, you're going to tell me, Seb, why are you talking about being patient and then having a sense of urgency? Let me tell you why. Because being patient, it's about your long-term goals. It's about what you're planning for your life. It's something that you're going to, you know, every single day, you're going to pour into it in order to get something big at the end. But that, that's what patient is about. The king, once again, became king even though it was his birthright from from, me, from the, his mother's moon, he knew he was going to be king. But he only been crowned king later on, very late. But in the meantime, I'm sure that everything he's done, everything he's done leading up to that point has been done with a sense of urgency. Because you know what? Who can guarantee me or you how long you got left to live? How, how long you got left to live? There's so many of us, so many of you, for whatever reason, and I'm still wondering why. You think, oh, you know what? Oh, Seb, do that. Okay, you know, I'll do it in two weeks. I'll start in two weeks. I'll look at my schedule. I'll start in two weeks. But what guarantees you that you're going to still be there in two weeks? Whatever you're going to do, whatever milestone you're going to go through, you know, you're going to validate, you're going to stamp, put a stamp on. You gotta do it with a sense of urgency because if you treat your life, whatever you're doing on a daily basis, with that urgency, with that mindset of, you know what, I might not be there tomorrow, <gasps> you're gonna, that's gonna give a total different look and quality to whatever you're trying to do or whatever you're doing on the day. And that's what I'm talking about. I want you to be dedicated, intentional about what you're doing. Stop because we do procrastinate because let me tell you there's one thing that is sure is life never gonna stop let me tell you that again life never gonna stop so when you do put things oh i'm starting two days three days you know what can happen between now between the moment you're saying that and the next three days a lot of things can happen but champions you are champion and let me tell you look at look around you Look all the champions that you admire. They think they're taking care of business on the day, on the spot. They don't put it back to tomorrow. You, we've been through Champions League, right? Do you really think they're already thinking about the final? They don't. They had to do, to deal with what was in front of them right now. So they had to play with a sense of urgency. When they do run, do you really think that they can jog unless you are using ball and you can pace your yourself 
but in any sport you have to attack if you pace it if you know what i'm gonna just catch them at the end you might lose because you're not ready because you haven't put whatever it takes that's what i'm saying you got to live life with a sense of urgency you got to live life like if it was your last day on earth because if it was your last day on earth what would you do which intensity would you put into whatever you're doing if it was if you knew that was your last day and touch hood no god forbid we get ill why do we change why, why do we adopt a new attitude with more intensity that when we're not healed when we know we don't receive a bad so quote for quote a bad news we don't we're chilling and then we're surprised that we can't really you know pass the milestone validate check 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 that's what we're gonna do but how live with a sense of urgency champions live with a sense of urgency and so you are you gotta that you know what your life is gonna be better it's gonna be better you gotta improve that's what we're here for and listen let me tell you let me give you the tip the tip of the day you stop expecting to get something new in order to live with urgency let me explain you always think oh, i'm gonna get there i'm gonna acquire this skill no start with what you got that's the for me that's the main thing stop expecting something new what you got is enough start with what you have and trust me what you got is enough to have this urgency because you have talent you have skills you have superpower trust yourself discover them but trust yourself and that's why that's how you're going to be able to start on the day the urgency we're talking about, we talked about the patience about the long-term goals but we're talking about small step great distances small goals every single day i want you to cherry your win how because you're going to put 110 percent of energy yeah you know on the boxing ring what do you really think that they're thinking about oh no 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 i'm going to relax because i want to be a world champion no every single fight every single punch that they send you know jab ha, the, the jab every single jab that they send it's going to be efficient it's going to hurt that that's what they're going to live with a certain urgency if they don't they get knocked out and that's what i'm talking about what about your life what is the this alarm bell that you we all need to wake us up what is the alarm bell that you need that's going to make you think you know what i ain't got so much time left i'm 36 turning to 37 i've spent quite a lot of time on earth already check yourself what have you done with that time and that's that's my challenge of the day guys so guys when you get on that on that green rectangle that represents your life and your life only take what is yours don't don't waste time that's yours take it own it because the the power the strength the happiness the improvement the urgency the health the wealth we don't only take it what we're we doing we snatch it you snatch it take what is yours yes that was your homeboy Seb Basson aka okay, Baby Bass always here to serve you thumbs up don't forget thumbs up subscribe and pass it around I'm here for you we're here for one another Leave with a sense of urgency. It's time now, not tomorrow. Right now. Let's go. Bye bye. Ra.